What's up guys, welcome back to another XCT video and as you remember from my previous video I have mentioned that I'm going to explain why I changed the name of the series from £10 to £5 and the reason is that I have received messages from my sponsor that in one month is the Body Power Expo and I have to attend the Body Power Expo with my sponsor to represent them there but I also have a big problem now with my university exams because on those days, on that weekend, I also have my university exams. And as you can see from my timetable over here, I have exams on Friday and Monday. So the Body Power Expo is on Friday, Saturday and Sunday. So probably I'm going to the Body Power Expo on Saturday, but I'm not sure yet guys, because if I go to the Body Power Expo, that means that I'm going to waste uh, one day from my exams and I don't really know if it's gonna be a good idea because this year is my final year at university and there are no jokes I mean if you don't pass any unit you don't get the degree so I will see what I'm going to do and I will probably decide in the in the last week you know just five days before the body power expo if I'm going to attend there and I really want to go to the body power because I was there the last year and many people came to me from you guys and uh, to show your support that you're watching videos of mine uh, I didn't I wasn't so popular the last year I only had my Facebook page running and my Facebook page is really popular on more than 100,000 followers there but the reality is that I'm not using Facebook anymore because the algorithm of Facebook is shit and nobody can see what you are posting so I don't really use my Facebook anymore just for messages and that's it I mostly use my snapshot right now so make sure that you follow me on snapshot guys and obviously YouTube as you know I'm uploading every Monday videos on YouTube as you remember I told you that I'm going to plan to upload videos every day I'm not sure guys I mean this is impossible at the moment as I told you university exams are very important for me and the other problem I have is not is that I don't just have my university I also have my my work I also have my online clients I have the company with my brother software CY the is the company that you see in all my videos we create websites I'm doing personally SEO rank websites to number one on Google so this is what I'm doing right now because it is really difficult guys to produce videos every single day trust me one of these videos that you see right now it takes six hours of editing and this is absolutely crazy so back to our workout guys as you can see i have gained 1.5 kilos 1.5 kilos is 3.3 pounds if you are from the united states so we're doing pretty good the bulking is going pretty good but I, I don't think that i'm going to continue this crazy massive amount of food that i'm eating right now okay it's not really massive because to be honest i started the the diet very aggressively with 5,000 calories per day but as soon as I received my message from my sponsor that I have to attend the Body Power Expo I started to cut down the calories so right now I'm eating around 3,000 to, to 3,500 uh, calories just to gain progressively slow weight and also I'm, I'm trying to keep my body fat as low as possible as you can see from the beginning of the video I did a small posing and I'm also going to do a posing on the end of the video just after the workout because you know you can see the pump and it's more you know impressive the physique my plans are to gain maybe a, another two pounds just to to finish the series guys because I promise you that I'm going to show you how to gain five pounds in 30 days to be honest it is really easy to gain five pounds I mean five pounds is like nothing honestly you can gain five pounds in one week and as you can see I didn't gain much fat mostly I think I'm gaining water and the reason is if you have if you eat too many carbs the carbs are converted from your liver to glycogen and if you have too much glycogen in your body your muscles are looking more, more pumped so don't be afraid to eat carbs guys because they really help you with the muscle growth progress 
So as you can see, this workout only took me around 45 minutes to finish and I did uh, seven exercises. I started the workout with two press exercises. As you can see from, I did barbell military press and seated Smith military press. And the reason I'm starting with is these exercises I always start my workouts, any muscle group, either it's chest, either it's back, either it's shoulders. Uh, as you see from this video, I always start with a press exercise, which press exercises are usually the hardest exercises to perform. And these are mo the most beneficial exercises to gain weight, and to, to gain muscle, to gain strength. So always start your workout with the hardest exercises, with the exercises that are actually I don't know how to explain you it's like it's press exercises this is what I, um, I call them for example barbell military press uh, seated military press what else it, it, for the chest is the incline bench press or the flat bench press whatever you like for the back is like pull downs these are the exercises that you have to start your workouts and the strongest always the strongest exercise to start any workout to see some serious gains, to see some serious results. Don't start with stupid exercises. For example, a stupid exercise for me to start your workout, for example, side lateral raises. You will not start the shoulders workout with side lateral raises because this exercise is mostly for stretching, to stretch out the muscle. Or another example I can give you for the chest is the flies. For example, you never start your chest work out with flies because flies is again is a stretching exercise so always start your workouts with a press exercise this is my advice that i can give you is one of the best advices you can get honestly in this video i haven't done much commentary about the workout i just wanted to talk to you guys to to tell you what's going on with the body power expo uh, when i'm going to start my cutting actually i never i didn't mention when i'm going to start my cutting diet so i'm going to start my cutting diet in two weeks so what i suggest you guys follow me on snapchat because i do q a's i answer questions i also post my meals some sneak peeks of my workouts so make sure that you follow me on snapchat guys instagram of course and i'm going to see you next week i'm going to do another two episodes of this series just to reach our goal so my goal of this series is to reach around 73 kilos to be honest 72 73 kilos keep my body fat as low as possible and i'm gonna see you on the next monday workout to do and this workout only took me 30 minutes to complete this is the reality guys I train only for 30 minutes I don't go for the gym for more than 40 minutes the most I can be to the gym is when I have I would say um, actually none of the muscles no none of the muscles